I'm Barbara, this is Malcolm, and I'm an ex-teacher. Malcolm had his own business, and when we retired, we went to live in France for 12 years, which was wonderful. And we came back to England six years ago, and had to kind of reunite and learn things about England again. And one of the nice things has been Tammy's Wellbeing Cafe. I think so, don't you? Yeah, I do. Yes. I think when I first heard about it, which was about six weeks ago, <laughs> being a bit, um, oh, I don't know, I, I wasn't expecting it to be what it was. I somehow thought we'd all be sitting around singing. <laughs> and when we came in and we saw these tables beautifully laid out with tea and volunteers who welcomed us and had a real um, interaction with us, I felt it, it, this is different. Um, this is something that you feel belonging to. Am I, am I right? Yes, absolutely, yeah. Yes. Um, we've only been coming, we missed the first two weeks because we were away, but we've been coming, I suppose it's four or five weeks now, and there's always been something different. There's been a talk or an activity, um, we've sat at different tables, we've chatted to different people, and although we're not isolated in the sense that there's only one of us at home, it's still good for both of us, isn't it? To, Yes, up. it is to come up and meet people. And yes, um, and that's that's what it is about, I think. And it's also, for me, it's um, as Malcolm's carer. It's also a place where I can talk to, say, for example, Tammy or one of the district nurses if she's here. Uh, but it's a place where the volunteers have a real interest in you. They're not simply saying, "Hi, go and sit over there." They are really knowing who you are, and that's very, very important. So some of the things we've seen here, besides the delicious plates of cakes and sandwiches, have been very, very interesting. The first talk we came to was from Wiltshire Farm Foods, which, as we do use them now and then, it, it was very interesting to hear what she said, Able to try some of the samples, didn't we? Yes. Um, and she, she was she was very good. Um, we've had two of the gentlemen from Active Plus doing very thoughtfully arranged um, activities, not just, for example, throwing a ball around, but activities that make you work things out, like <laughs> having to haul something out of a bucket, which yes, is a circle. circle. You couldn't step into the circle and a sort of domino game as well. And that was, that's very good because we all had to think about it. And today we've had the eyesight group from Truro, what we used to be called the Truro Blind Society. And as Malcolm is a member of that, we know them well, but it's always good to see some of the things that they bring. Mm -hmm. So I think all these peripheral things, you think they're quite important, yes? Oh, I do, yeah. yes. Yes. We look forward to other things.